Am I recording? Yeah. Had some work today. That was good. Always good to get work. Um, just want to talk about two things. Hacking. And what hacking means to you. And um, family connections or secret family connections or something you're not proud of, maybe. Um, anyway, hacking. So companies hack. Um, it could be legal, could be illegal. Many companies hack legally as such. They employ someone to test their systems and they... Um, what do you say? They um, they might employ certain people who um, were illegal and now legal because they know how things work. Um, one thing is um, banking, banking and uh, financial apps. They're fairly secure, but um, people can get through. So you've got to update the systems all the time and um, people that are involved in hacking um, have to be one step ahead all the time um, because there's a, a new virus or a new way to get in. Uh, governments, organisations, MI5, MI6, um, they all use hackers. Uh, I'm hacked myself I know that I'm hacked but I'm kind of not bothered because um, the only thing I've got encrypted is the uh, the bank account um, and other bits and pieces but um, anything else is um, I'm pretty open anyway so uh, I don't mind but I'm pretty sure most of you are hacked by something normally you are hacked by um, uh, like a sales uh, type app like a um, kind of a viewing uh, tool so people can see what you're into so if you uh, click on your uh, social media page and you click on an interest that will show up on another platform if you've got them linked uh, that will click up on uh, another social media platform so they know that you want that particular or you're interested in that particular product but um, you can do things so you can pay people to um, unhack your system and then it's normally hacked again, but you uh, you can create um, programs and various things. Um, the more uh, you create a, a defense, the more it's going to cost you to uh, to defend ag against the uh, say the illegal sources. Anyway, let's talk also about uh, mafia. Uh, mafia. I mentioned it before, and it's an interesting thing to watch. Yeah, it's an interesting thing to watch. Now, something I've not mentioned, um, I don't need to mention it really, because um, I'm not involved. I'm not involved in anything illegal. Mine, I guess people would say that, that have connections. They would say that anyway, but um, yeah. So uh, there are certain connections in my family. So something, as I say, I'm not proud of. Um, I won't mention uh, the particular family, but uh, let's say they fairly well known. Yeah, so um, <clears throat> they do get involved in, or did get involved, because there's not much of it now, between the year, um, or my year I was around, um, and I heard about these things going on, 76 it was quite a big year up to about 82, 81, 82. Um, a lot of things happening now. Innocent people have got hurt, they've got killed. Um, kind of things that um, have happened to these uh, people is uh, so they've got shot and it's um, mistaken identity. I get kind of um, edgy talking about this sort of thing anyway, but. Um, not nice, not good. Anyway, yeah. Um, used to be a lot of bombs going off as well, especially early 80s. There was a certain, um, well, all around the world, really, but uh, certain parts in America and Northern Ireland, there's an awful lot of bombs going off, and um, it wasn't pleasant, not pleasant. There's also... Um, uh, there's also a thing of... Um, 
of honor and um, there used to be more honor in the, in the olden days we're talking about the olden days now it's kind of um, there's all deals going off and everything and um, yeah it's not um, not something I want to be personally involved in um, I'm sure no one else does as well but a lot of those businesses that are out there uh, were corrupt but now they're they're legal so there's a lot of businesses running now especially government business um, or businesses that are connected with different governments that were illegal that are completely legal and they're running uh, they're running a good business running a good show there are also illegal businesses that um, certain fractions of the family didn't get involved in because they didn't want to be involved in that sort of thing so they picked and choose so there was various oh, I mean there's a whole family out there it's not only uncles there's aunties there's the children there's um, everyone involved is um, is not all bad so uh, they're just connected in some way yeah um, yeah don't get me wrong I've been um, of uh, been enhanced on the DBS updated all the time and uh, also uh, yeah so don't worry but um, yeah do I see them now I don't want to talk about anything like that now but um, hmm, interesting interesting little lives that they led not me of course um, yeah can't go into it too much so if you, if you say things they've got to be factual really if they're not factual, then uh, legalities come into it. People can get into trouble. Legally, they can get into trouble. And also, illegally. Um, yeah. I'm an open book anyway. But I do find um, that type of thing interesting. And uh, as I say, I look at uh, all the websites now. Michael um, Michael Francis. What's his name? Michael Francis. And... Um, uh, um, other people that uh, kind of um, puts a put something in in me to uh, to talk about them, but um, anyway, it's uh, interesting, just interesting. It just is war, peace. What makes people tick, you know? But um, hmm. yeah, I've got to go for now. But I'll um, I'll do something later on or something I'll be back or um uh, anyway I'll, I'll talk later I've got to go and prepare something later cheers